Following the sudden announcement of the implementation of Citizenship Amendment Act CAA across the country by the center, massive protests have been seen, especially in the Northeastern state of Assam. Chief Advisor, Northeast Student Organization and All Assam Students Union, Samujal Bhattacharya, speaking exclusively to Hornbill TV, said that the CAA was a protector of illegal Bangladeshis. He said it was unconstitutional, communal and anti-indigenous and anti-northeast violating the Assam Accord. He informed that a petition has been filed in the Supreme Court challenging the CAA since 2019 and that a fight against the act will continue. Let's have a look. My sir is back. Uh, Dr. Sumujal Kumar Bhattasar Jai, who is a NESO's CIP advisor and all, all of some students are also a CIP advisor. We are going to talk about them. दरअसल ये जाना चाहेंगे सीए को आप लोग क्यों आपस कर रहे हैं? सी डी सीए इस ए प्रोटेक्टर ऑफ इलीगल बांग्लादेशीज इस ए अनकॉन्स्टिट्यूशनल इस ए कम्युनियल एट एंटी 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 इंडिजिनियस एंटी नॉर्थीस भाईलेटी पर भी असम एकॉर्ड सो वी आर रिपोर्टिंग का एंड सी डी ड्यूटी इन फ्लैक्स ऑफ इलीगल फॉरेनर्स and uh, if we discuss about this issue, the Supreme Court of India had said uh, that when the Supreme Court of India struck down the IMDT Act, that time Supreme Court of India had said due to large-scale influx of illegal foreigners from Bangladesh, there is external aggression and internal disturbance in the state of Assam. Assam ka, regarding Assam, uh, Supreme Court of India had said. Because everybody had say, everybody had said, ask what is the number? Supreme Court of India has, had said, due to large scale influx of illegal foreigners from Bangladesh, there is external aggression and internal disturbance in the state of Assam. It is only in the case of Assam. Then you just visualize the uh, the gravity of the problem in other parts of the northeastern region. See, uh, the, we, the, we have seen the uh, effect of uh, the uh, illegal influx of illegal Bangladeshis in northeast. What is the situation in Tripura? The total population of Tripura is 40 lakhs. Out of 40 lakhs, indigenous Tripuris are only 15 lakhs. We, we have explained the situation of uh, Assam. The Guwahati High Court, in one of his judgment, had said the illegal foreigner can enter uh, in the state of Assam. They can enroll their name in the electoral of Assam. And they became kingmaker in the state of Assam. And if this phenomenon continues, then illegal Bangladeshis will intrude upon the corridor of power. And the indigenous people of Assam, Hindus and Muslim both, will become minority in their own motherland. It is, it, is it is a view of the Guwahati High Court. So that is the gravity. So uh, we cannot accept Ka because uh, Northeast is not a dumping ground for illegal Bangladeshis. We have seen the effect in Tripura, now in Assam. Now we have seen the effect in the state of Meghalaya. We have seen the effect in the uh, other states like Nagaland, uh, Manipur, then Urnasal. We have seen, uh, we have seen the border areas of Assam and Nagaland. Uh, what is happening there? So illegal Bangladeshis are roaming around. They are roaming around, and it's a threat to the identity of the indigenous people of northeastern region. We have seen the bad effects of Tripura and Assam, and gradually it, it is. It, we, are, we, we have seen the effects in other parts of Northeast and region. So we like to tell the central government that uh, Northeast is not a dumping ground for illegal Bangladeshis. The rulers of the country, the intellectuals of the country, they don't think there is a part of the country beyond Calcutta. They don't think. So here, here it is Northeast. It is also part of the country. The 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 indigenous people of Assam and Northeast. We'd also like to stay like a good citizen like other parts of the country. But the government is not allowing. Only for the sake of illegal Bangladesh's vote banks, they are, they are bringing, they are imposing ka on the, uh, on the people of Northeastern region. And uh, see, uh, we have seen the activities of the political parties also. There is a, there is a, there is a movement, mass movement in Assam. Six years long, non-violent Assam movement. And during that Assam movement, 860 people have sacrificed their life. They, they are the martyrs of the Assam movement. Thousand becoming physically handicapped due to police torture and firing. And, and the, the 
after the after the 6 years long assam movement the historic assam accord was signed aur 2019 mein jo ca ka protest hua tha jordar protest hua tha pure assam ke aadmi aap logo ka sath diya tha protest ke dauran paas yuvak bhi mare gaye the to abhi is samay dekha jata hai ki jab lagu ho gaya lagu hone ke baad jitna aadmi nikal ke aana chahiye tha aap logo ka sath dena tha lekin dikhai nahi de raha ye iska kya kaam nahi see two two things two things are there uh after historic assam movement history assam accord was signed an indian accord it is said that who have entered up to 71 he may be hindu he may be muslim they can stay in assam but beyond 71 he may be muslim he may be hindu and they must be deported assam is a very small state we cannot take load beyond 71 tro ka the government of india want to impose more illegal bangladeshis up to 2014 how we can take load how assam cannot take load beyond 71 north is cannot take load of illegal bangladeshis now if we assess the journey of the moment initially they have introduced uh, rules on the people of north is 2000 from 2000 2014 15 we are continuing this movement movement on behalf of north is student organization we are we are continuing this movement throughout north is It's a northeast centric movement. In Assam, it's an Assam centric movement. In Assam, all Assam students in an thirty ethnic organization. We are, we are, uh, we are initiating this movement along with the other other like minded organization. In northeast, it is northeast student organization. Northeast student organization is the umbrella student organization of consisting of all Assam students in and from Assam, Naga student federation from Nagaland, Khasi students in and Garo students in and from Meghalaya. Mizoram Jilai Paul from Mizoram Tripura Student Federation from Tripura all Manipur students in and from Manipur and all Arunachal Pradesh students in and from Arunachal it's a umbrella organization of northeast uh, it neso from from the from day one we are opposing that notification from 2014 15 earlier it was notification then it is became cab when cab was imposed on us then neso took the initiative we had we had we had discussed with all political parties uh, uh, including the opposition and the nga partners during that time we we went to meet the uh, uh, cp bihar we went to meet the uh, sip sena sif uh, we met the other national party leaders we had lobbied on behalf of neso we have lobbied uh, uh, we have taken adopted some mechanism to contact all the uh, national leaders regional leaders uh, of northeastern region and our national leaders of the country so that they can extend their support to the people of north eastern region and during during the, the due to the correct effective initiative on the part of neso that time the cap cannot be passed in the parliament now the central government they have in the second part they have introduced this car and when this car was introduced when the cap was introduced first there was north is born the people of north is had opposed this cap there was north is born called by neso when again car was introduced the central government tried to adopt some divisive politics what is divisive politics the central government has said this time during imposition of car that inner land covered states are exempted what are the what are the inner land covered state earlier it was mizoram nagaland arunachal pradesh overnight they have given inner land to manipur also so now in mizoram uh mizoram nagaland arunachal pradesh and manipur is exempted from ka that is number 1 then central government has said that six scheduled covered areas are exempted where are the six scheduled areas 98% of meghalaya is covered by six scheduled area more than 70% is covered in the tripura in assam uh that is btr area that is uh, uh, that is in borderland territorial council that is uh, कोकराझार दैन सिरांग दैन तमुलपुर दैन बास्का एंड उदालगुरी अब दैट बी टी सी एरिया एंड दि हिल डिस्ट्रिक्स दैट इज कार्वि एलॉ वेस्ट कार्वि एलॉ एंड डिमा हासा इज एक्जेमटेड नाउ इफ यू सी दि मैप अब नॉर्थ इज वेर इज का एंड वेर इज नॉट का मिजोराम देर इज नो का इन मिजोराम अरुणाचल प्रदेश नागालैंड मणिपुर There is no car in the 98% of Meghalaya because of six-seat area, covered area. 
more than 70 percent of in Tripura because of six little area and in Assam out of 35 districts in eight districts there is no car so we have a question to the prime minister of the country home minister of the country if car is bad for the inner and cover states of northeast if car is bad for the six little areas of northeast and Assam how this car can be good for the other parts of Assam and Northeast, which is not covered by inner land permit and six little area. It's an it's a injustice. So this car must go. Car must go and uh, here in Assam, the only way to solve this vex financial problem is to implement all clauses of the Assam Accord. That is number one. And for whole of Northeast, there must be a comprehensive approach to solve this vex financial problem. And Northeast is not a dumping ground for illegal Bangladeshis. So now, when this car was imposed, that time uh, we had decided to launch the non-violent, uh, peaceful, democratic movement. At that time, there was a movement throughout Northeast and in Assam. In Assam, there was a mass movement. Throughout Northeast, there was a movement. Because when Neso had a meeting, we had, we had discussed what to do. Because four states are exempted, six little covers are exempted, what to do? Then Neso had decided, no, it's a divisive politics of the, on the part of the government of India. If Assam is facing problem, if the indigenous people of Tripura is, Tripura is facing problem, it is a problem of the other states of the Northeastern region also. The indigenous people of Northeastern region are united. We cannot allow the central government to adopt divisive politics on the indigenous people of Northeast. So when Imka was imposed, there was Northeast bond. There was a united Northeast bond against this car. And after that, there was a legal fight. The first petition was filed by all Assam Students Union on behalf of the people of Northeast before the Supreme Court of India. Then on behalf of Northeast Student Organ, NESO, we had filed petition before the Supreme Court of India. Then other organization and individual, they have filed petition in the, in, in, in the Supreme Court of India. And in the, when that hearing took place on the first day, there, because from whole of the country, there was 2000, more than 2040 petitions were there. So everybody had talked about their own issues. But the advocates of Neso and Asu had pleaded our case in a very effective manner. I had said the situation of other parts of the country and situation of Assam and Northeast is something different. And in Assam, we have Assam Accord. In Tripura, the population pattern we have seen. Out of 40 lakhs, only 15 lakhs are indigenous. In other, other states of Northeast, we have seen the effect of illegal Bangladeshis. So you cannot equate the situation of Northeast with the other parts of the country. So then, after hearing the pleading of the advocates of Neso and Asu, the Supreme Court has said, okay, the, the issues of Assam, Tripura and Northeast are different. So there will be same hearing, but there will be separate time uh, slot for the, uh, for the case of Assam, Tripura and Northeast. So uh, after that also the hearing was taken place and uh, the, the, there, was, the, there, was a, there is a routine, it was framed. And in that, in that routine, the, there, will be, there is a separate time for Assam, Tripura and Northeast. So, so you have last time, as you have heard of Lok Sabha, the political party has been busy in the election. So, how do you think about the Andalan? So after after four years, see, we have filed filed this petition challenging car in 2019. Okay, Nes, Asu and Neso, we had filed the petition in 2019. Four years has passed. After four years, the central government they have imposed this regulation now. Okay, now we are opposing that regulation. So oh, in Assam there is statewide protest, but it is non-violent, peaceful, movement, democratic movement through notice. Throughout Northeast, the Northeast student organization NESO had initiated uh, this movement. And there was, there was a Northeast wide protest by burning the uh, copies of the uh, regulation. Now, we have decided to launch the non peaceful movement and legal fight simultaneously. And uh, yesterday, um, on behalf of the people of Northeast, the All Assam Students Union had filed a petition before the Supreme Court of India challenging the regulation and praying for stay of this regulation. And now, on behalf of NESU, we are also preparing petition. We are discussing with the advocates of the Supreme Court of India. On behalf of NESU, we have also decided to file petition before the Supreme Court of India, challenging this regulation. 
and regulation also. The main case is already there. In 2019, we had filed on behalf of ASU and we, on behalf of NESO. Now, ASU had filed uh, the petition challenging that regulation now. Mm -hmm. Now, NESO is also preparing to file petition before the Supreme Court of India. Now, the road, what is the road map? The continuous, non-violent, peaceful, democratic movement and legal fight. There is no place of violence in our movement. Non-violent, peaceful, democratic movement and legal fight. Both will continue. Last may uh Pasno Uta Yapset to Rajana Sange or me to uh Prime Minister Narendra Modi led government uh Asam Kajo Jimonta Bishop Samaka government is a Yeju C A Bareme Ulugia support Milneka Sanse after the central government is imposing this act only for the sake of food things. See what we have seen in the country. Some political parties they want illegal illegal Muslim Bangladeshi food, some political parties wants illegal Hindu Bangladeshi foods. They are, not, they are not at all concerned about the uh, interest of the indigenous people of North East. Parallelly, we will we'll con we, we, we'll continue our movement in a non-violent, peaceful, democratic way and a legal fight. Simon Pilesley will continue that. Legal fight will be on in the Supreme Court. At the same time, there will be non-violent, peaceful, democratic movement. Yes, Dr. Samuchar Kumar Bhattasai, who told us that this is the Andalus, this is the Andalus, and this is the Andalus, and this is the Andalus, and this is the Andalus.